Semua pihak di negara ini perlu berganding bahu dalam realisasikan matlamat pembangunan mampan atau SDG 2030 pertumbuhan bangsa besar itu PBB. Demikian tegas uh, Presiden Global Green Institute yang juga bekas setiausaha agung PBB Ban Ki-moon dalam siri syarahan mengenai keamanan sejagat dan pembangunan mampan di Universiti Bangsaan Malaysia UKM hari ini. Hanya tempoh 4 tahun pelaksanaannya, SDG memberi impak positif namun masih banyak yang perlu kita lakukan. But progress is unfortunately uneven on others, depending upon where you are living. And we need to move forward with a renewed sense of commitment, renewed sense of urgency, with only 11 years to go before 2030. Additionally, conflicts around the world and the deepening climate crisis are leading to traveling reversals in SDG implementations on the ground. To achieve the SDGs by 2030, we need an all-hands-on-the-deck approach, where everyone joins together in partnership to harness the ownership, stronger ownership, participation, and achieve active involvement from all sectors of our society. Sekiranya tiada tindakan serius, kerosakan mungkin berterusan terhadap bumi dan membawa kepada tragedi alam yang mengancam keselamatan manusia sejagat. Kerjasama di antara kerajaan, pemimpin, masyarakat serta ahli akademik perlu diperkukuhkan seperti yang termaktub dalam perjanjian Paris 2015. I truly believe that the Paris Agreement offers us our best hope to preserve over the serious threats to our alien planet. But to achieve this goal, again, we need to work together. Climate change is a global challenge demanding global solutions. No country, nobody, however powerful or resourceful one may be, can address this climate change issue alone. This is why we, young and old, all of us, young and old, rich and poor, men and women, Muslim and Buddhist, Christians, have a stake in forging sustainable solutions in response to it. Malah golongan muda jelas kimun perlu bersuara dalam memelihara bumi. Dalam konteks Malaysia, jelas kemun kualiti pendidikan juga teras keempat perlu dititik beratkan agar pemahaman mengenai pembangunan mampat diterapkan. Kemun berkata demikian ketika memberi cuarahan Global Peace Sustainable Development Anjuran Fakulti Sains Sosial dan Kemanusiaan UKM di Bangi pada Rabu. Terdahulu, kemun menerima ijazah kehormat keamanan sejagat dan pembangunan mapan dari UKM dalam Hadis Convocation UKM ke-47.